it's time to play. Hello, welcome back to another video on this channel. I hope you're doing well today. Today we are doing the official review on the movie Halloween Kills. So, um, I was going to do it in October, but I, I had some... Because I, obviously, I'm not old enough to go into the cinema to go see it. So I had to wait for it to come out on DVD and it took a while for me to go get it. But I've got it now, so I've seen it. And, um, yeah, I'm going to do a video on it. If you enjoy, make sure you like and subscribe and let's begin with the video. So, first of all, um, how good was this film? I mean, yeah, all right, maybe not as good as mo like other ones, but it was. it's not on the scale of worst Halloween film ever. It's more of a, like, mm, it's good. But it's not the best. Like it's a, it's good. Like it's one of my favorite films. So that's pretty much what I'm trying to say. It is now one of my favorite films. I really enjoyed this film. One of the best Halloween, in my opinion. So um, I think I like how they've got um, how they've brought in flashbacks of the original film. But the original film we never saw. Well, obviously, they recreated it, but, like, it was meant to be in, like, in the original film, but we never got it. So, like, we found other characters that we never knew about, which was, well, I just think it was very, like, and then you've got, like, Tommy, um, and, um, just all of them doing a toast, like, all the legendary characters coming back, and... How they were doing a toast for Laurie as she was bleeding out in um the truck as the firemen come and try to save Michael as like obviously she said let him burn. But um yeah you gotta kinda feel bad for those firemen like because they're just doing the job and they get killed. But um yeah, I just think um this film was overall really cool. Then, obviously, after he kills the fireman, because, obviously, we all knew the fire scene was going to happen, because it was in the trailer. But, um, yeah, I just really thought it was pretty cool. And then, obviously, you got um, him going into the old couple's home, where he killed them. And then he got that, uh, what was it? After he, well, he didn't kill the guy first, he just smashed his head quite a bit. And then he took, like, what was it, a light bulb thing, and he smashed it. And the way he stabbed the woman, and then, because he was twisting it, and you can hear, like, like how brutal it was. And then, like, that was one that was one of my favourite, but it's not my favourite. I'll get into that in a minute. So, yeah, as he was stabbing him, and you can hear it, and then I thought it was pretty funny how he kept getting different knives and stabbing the guy. Multiple times with multiple knives. I thought that was pretty funny. But my favourite kill. Out in this film. Is probably. You know in the scene. Where um you've got. They're at the park. And they're in the car. And the woman's shooting at Michael. After Michael's you know killed some of them. And she's shooting. And then he opens the door. And the gun tw like turns to her. And she pulled the trigger and it kills her. I I thought that was the best kill of the film. You could say whatever you want. Like that 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 was one of my favourite kills. I think a close second would be that the one I just um said. But um yeah, I can't, I can't believe um Karen is dead. Like wow. So I think that's gonna leave like, Laurie and Alison, very angry. Especially how the ending was when she went, I'm coming for you, Michael. As Laurie was walking down the corridor of the hospital, wearing a knife, like, holding a bloody knife. But I'm pretty sure if that was real life, she would have been arrested. But, mm, I still think, like, the worst part of this film was... When the like everyone was chasing after that uh, accomplice or whatever it was, that escaped with Michael Myers. As he all he wanted to, to do was get help, like he even said, "Help me." Good thing Karen came and helped him. Well, tried to at least, but everyone kept going, and then 
he, he, he got too scared, he committed suicide and jumped off. And I just think that's like, it's pretty sad when you think about it. But, oh, I just, it's part of the film though. Like, I think I just think that's probably the worst part of the film. The rest is bang on. I like how they bring back old characters like Lindsay, um, and then, like the nurse from the first one that Michael grabs and like you know smashes the window. I think that was pretty um, cool, and I like how she she's about to shoot um, Michael. And then she says, this is for Dr. Loomis. So I like how they brought like his name into it. But unfortunately for her, the gun was um, ran out of bullets. So that kind of um, backfired for her and that's how she died. But um, yeah, I, I thought Karen's death was, well, I don't know. It was, I don't think it's. It was overly bad because I didn't care too much for her. But I just think Alison is definitely going to be raging. But I just want to see what she's going to be like in the end. Four years later, she lost her mum and her dad to Michael Myers. So she's going to be fuming. But only time will tell. Um, because they finished filming, yes, well, no, it's probably two days from the time this is getting uploaded, but from how I'm recording it, it is, um, they finished recording it yesterday, so I think it's going to be out October time, I hope it is, I do not want it to come any time, like, but they can, because then, time, like, say if they release it, like, what, August, September, because then... Um, hopefully I can get the DVD and all in time for Halloween. Because then I can, um, watch End. But I'd probably wait until, um, uh, what was it? The actual Halloween night. So I think that would be cool. Because everyone loves Halloween night. And I know that, like, it's going to be cool. But, um, yeah, I, th I think ends will be pretty cool, especially when we find out what Michael Myers is doing. It's like, I don't know, you, you knew Michael Myers deserved to get killed, right? But you kind of felt bad for him when he was getting smacked, like, beaten up by, like, everyone. But then you just think, nah, like, what team you're on? But when you think about it, if this was real life, everyone would want to kill him. But, yeah, well, they do. But, it like, I don't know. He should have just been killed there and then. Then knowing that he could, Dr. Loomis was actually going to kill him. But he got stopped. So it could have been over. But I don't think it would be. Even if he shot him in the head, I do not think Michael Myers would die. I think he would stay alive. But, yeah. I mean, he got burnt. Like, he got put in a house full of fire. And he survived. So, I don't think a bullet to the head's going to do much. Because I don't exactly think... Oh, I don't know. They need to do something. But, I don't know. If they're going to kill him off, they need to find a good way to do it. I don't think the shape can die. But... But he can't. But I don't know how they're going to kill him otherwise. Because how are they going to make... They're not going to make any more films. But how are they going to end it? That's what I want to know. But yeah. I just think... 100%. They just need to find a good way. I just hope they don't do a stupid reason to kill him off. But I think I'm going to be doing another separate video. On... Uh, how I think they should kill off or anything to michael myers but um or like it's gonna be like a video like will he die do i reckon he will die so stay tuned for that and um yeah like with karen's death it was a bit up like because the way he kept stabbing her and then he was looking out the window with the blood on his mask and then you see like before she went upstairs you could see like 
young Michael in his clown mask watching her, like, because looking out, um, Judith's window. But, um, yeah, that'll probably be the end for the video. If you liked today's video, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. See you later.